let's talk about the cusp and ridges of the premolars. They're right behind the canines. This is the mandible from your perspective, the lower jaw. And then this is the first premolar. We're going to be referring to this one for the video. Let's draw the directional terms. So we got our labial, buccal, distal, lingual, all labeled on the tooth. Now, if we took this occlusal perspective and we looked at it from the top, what we'll see is two cusps. All right, so these two cusps correspond to the buccal and the lingual. So again, this whole square is the occlusal. These are the directional terms, noting that this is the buccal side, the cheek. This is the lingual side, the tongue. Each of these is a cusp, looking at it from the over, overhead view. Now, when we have one cusp, we have four ridges. Use this compass. All right, so what you see is this compass corresponds to each of these ridges. So this would be the buccal ridge of the buccal cusp. This would be the lingual ridge of the lingual cusp. This would be the buccal ridge of the lingual cusp. Now keep in mind, this is this picture just turned a little bit, okay? Just turned a little bit, and we're, again, we're seeing that occlusal perspective. For premolars, we only have two cusps, and it's gonna be a buccal and a lingual. All right, make sure to check out the video on the molar cusps and ridges. This was Chaser Bordy with the game plan for your academics.